Welcome to For the Love of Brickle. How you doing? So glad to meet ya. Come and just stories just for a few. Hello, good day, and how do you do? Welcome to For the Love of Brickle, featuring Powder. <laughs> oh boy. Welcome, welcome, my people. I'm your girl, Brickle. You know, I always get ups and downs of things that occur in life. Though. So what exactly is Grace in Forward Plumber? Let's find out. <laughs> now, it has been four months since Grace and Plumber been together. So Grace has become the bay, the boo, the cherry on top, girlfriend for Plumber. You know, he's one and only, as far as we can see. And he calls her Muffin. Muffin, and she calls him Chucka Bear. Chucka Bear. It was 6 a.m. in the morning, and Plumber and Grace was finishing up their early morning workout routine. And yes, people, they did that at Plumber's house, you know, on the roof. Yeah. <laughs> now, while lying flat side by side, exhausted. Plumber turned to, you know, his baby Muffin and said, Grace, Muffin baby, what do you think about baby? And Grace, barely breathing properly, said, um, Chocolate Bear, why are you asking about baby so soon? Our relationship is still new, but we could speak more about baby when our relationship you know grows some more so Pema says ah okay fair enough while sapping his face dry with the towel so muffin took the towel from him and you know wiped off chuck -a bear's neck chest and shoulders <laughs> and she told him to sit up so she could you know Wipe that sexy back of his and you know, all dry. Then Plumber suddenly turned, spin her around, and put Grace to sit in his lap. Ooh. Both of them began laughing <laughs> as he hummed one of his favorite songs to his muffin. <laughs> At this very moment, Grace tried her best to keep her mind calm as she glanced on her phone just a little, waiting on that alarm to go off so that she can get ready for work. Plumber, her chocolate bear, started massaging her shoulders, mm, those muscular hands, huh? And kissed her neck and shoulders, and damn, you know, her chocolate beer is good with his hands. Um, while he watched her every motion, as you could, you, you could see the relief on her when you know he touched the you know right spots. Wake up. Yes, but before I go any further, please remember to like, share, subscribe, and click the notification bell. Please remember to select all so you can receive all notifications every time I upload a new video. Please remember to leave a comment in the comment section. Make sure it's humorous, vibesy, and all those good things. <laughs> oh boy. Chocolate Bear went as far as to massage and pull on her legs, her feet, her toes. He even kissed her feet. Mwah. Hey! You know, he has to ensure his muffin gets a proper massage and a proper stretch. Then her alarm went off. They both got up together and he held her face and gave her his special French kiss that makes Grace foot bottom scratch and toes curl and you know put her you know mind at ease 
she there feeling all light on her feet, you know? Yeah, man powerful like that, right? <laughs> and while she took her poor belongings to leave, he slapped her on her, you know, right butt cheek. Slap! And gave her a seductive smile. Wing! And said, Ha ha ha. That butt is getting firm and firmer by the minute. And Grace giggled <laughs> and said, Glad you noticed me. <laughs> See you later, Choco Bear. And Plumber yelled, ah. But of course I noticed. You're my light, eh? <laughs> well, Grace smiled from ear to ear, making her way over. Her house. No, while Grace was in the shower, all she could reflect on is Plumber's thick lips saying, Baby, and said to herself, I hope he don't think I will give him a baby unless he marries me first. But he's so damn sexy and buff. Wonder if I could take my chances. No, Grace, snap out of it. The aim is to enjoy each other's company while we are young. Don't complicate things. Grace then got dressed and went to work. As soon as Grace's alarm went off for lunchtime, Plumber called. Grace was elated and said, Hey, Choco Bear, how are you? Ah, hey, Muffin. You eating lunch with me and my bro and I today? And Grace said, Oh, okay, I will be downstairs in a bit. Just going to sign out for lunch first. And Plumber said, Splendid. While Grace made her way downstairs, she noticed his brother and him resemble a lot. Only difference is, his brother is little less bulky. So while they had lunch with his brother, his brother did most of the talking and questioning. So, how long have you been with my brother? Well, four months and happy. Then his brother said, I'm charmed. So has Plumber been treating you well? Don't lie for him now. So Grace said, Well, yeah, he has and has become even more serious. So his brother chuckled. <laughs> oh, <laughs> interesting. Plumber then... His Stare brother, that. while Grace continued observing the two, then Grace phone rang. It was mom. So she picked up right away and said, Hey, mama. <laughs> hey, Grace, where are you? Well, I'm on lunch break with Choco Bear and his brother. So mom said, Oh, okay. When you reach home, we talk. Then Grace said, is it serious? And mom said, Grace, honey, when you come home, we talk, okay? And she said, oh, all right, mom. And, you know, hung up the phone nervously. Then Plumber said abruptly, Muffin, are you all right? And Grace nervously said, yes, mom just want me to help her with some stuff as soon as I reach home. So Plumber's brother... Matthew says, My dear brother, does she know about Rachel? So Grace glared nervously at Pama. And people at this moment, Grace's mind was working overtime, wondering if she made a mistake being with such a charming guy. Grace all of a sudden had a nervous stomach. And I know what y'all thinking. No, Grace is not pregnant. But you know, she waited patiently for Plumber's response. Yeah, she does. And 
has a story for itself and Plummer chuckled <laughs> and so did Grace <laughs> then she said going to the restroom I'll be back Grace stared in the mirror and flushed her face with water and breathed easy <sighs> fixed her hair a little put on some lip balm washed her hands and made it back around the table to finish up lunch and made her way back to work grace was now home and mom was playing crossword puzzles on her android phone and immediately rest her phone down grace have a seat and grace said mom I have been nervous all day. What's happening? Well, Rachel, that so-called friend that was helping Plummer to release that steam, well, her white rose rice was parked outside his gate. So Chris said, you're joking, right? And mom said, nope. I am serious. Her vehicle was parked there over an hour. So Grace said, and this morning when he and I exercised together, he was talking up to me about baby. You know, me having a baby for him. And Grace's mother burst out with laughter. <laughs> Oh my gosh, girl. <laughs> As a mother, I have to say, Plummer isn't being honest with you about a lot of things. Grace immediately felt her heart sink. You know, she's trying to gasp for breath, trying to breathe easy, trying not to overthink trying to keep calm her mom then said grace you can't ignore the red flags grace eyes were filled with water people stay tuned for part five and find out what is going to become of chocolate bear plumber and Grace, a.k.a. Muffin. <laughs> I'm your girl, Brickle. You know, I was giving ups and downs of things that occur in life. Though, please remember to like, share, subscribe, and click that notification bell. Please remember to select all so that you can receive all notifications every time I upload a new video. Please remember to leave a comment in the comment section. Make sure it's humorous, vibesy. And all those good things. <laughs> oh boy. I hope you all enjoyed yourselves. Love you all. Peace. Mwah.